exercise, exercise, exercise. Alarm red. Mom four. Defend the base. Defend the base. Defend the base. We uh, in the MSG uh, are going on a purple rain bivouac. Uh, the exercise itself is actually a capstone event. Uh, it's a culmination of a year's worth of home station training. So all the mission support group squadrons are going out to RAF Feltwell where uh, there is a mock runway, there's a bare patch of land, and they're going to go and establish an air base uh, and potentially recover that air base. We've got injects and activities for all the security forces who's going to be teaching tactical movements, the comm squadron that's providing connectivity to everybody. Uh, we've got the civil engineers, which are, are really going to give the infrastructure to the, the bed down force and, and be prepared to recover the air base as well. Collecting data as well on our contingency tasks. Uh, every AFSC has their own set of requirements and, and tasks that they need to be able to accomplish downrange. Some of those tasks have to be accomplished in mock gear. At some time, those injects are going to flow and they're going to have to figure out how do I repair this water uh, line or how do I recover the airfield, but now I'm in chem gear. Secretary Kendall, our Secretary of the Air Force, put out a memo and asked us, what do we need to change? What do we need to do to be ready to go to war today if we were asked? Standing up this combat support training range, having Red Horse come out and build us a mock runway where we can actually practice recovering the airfield helps us, but then we're looking at guard bases coming to, to use this, uh, different bases within Europe to use this as a, a site that they can practice uh, their contingency tasks. So uh, we're looking at a lot of different folks from all over the world coming to utilize this space and really test it out and, and see what capabilities we can get from it. This has been five months in the making and it is a significant investment from all of MSG, but I think it speaks volumes to uh, how important readiness is to this wing uh, and to getting it right.